developing now at 11. There's a bizarre situation in South Miami right now. Police are investigating multiple reports of a strange object falling out of the sky. The search was centered around the area of Southwest 87th Street and Red Road. That's where CBS 4's Tiffany Helberg is live with the latest. Tiffany. Yeah, Natalia, investigators are still trying to figure this all out. They have several reports from many witnesses who say that they saw a large balloon, possibly a hot air balloon, on fire in the night sky, and then they say that it fell to the ground. But no one's been able to give an exact location or a definite description of it. Police and fire rescue spent at least two hours searching the area by car, boat, and helicopter. That search is now called off, and the only thing they found is a chunk of mesh on the side of the road that one of the neighbors found on fire. Now, we spoke to that man as well as an 11-year-old with his mom who saw the fire in the sky earlier tonight. And I saw a, a piece of, of wire uh, mesh thing that was, that was on fire. It was laying in the middle of the street. I parked my car, got out, and dragged it into the side of the road there was some gravel and i just covered it up and turned off the fire and we saw like a giant red like a huge intense red ball which flew right across the side and we thought it was a hot air balloon or we thought it was a plane like crashing and we didn't know what it was at all we thought it was a meteorite too and you came to report it yeah and i have a picture guess Let me it, it kind of looked like this thing not like that or it's the many options i had on my head and i had no choice what it looked like that 11-year-old's imagination is going to run wild tonight. But right now, we know that investigators are still trying to determine what that mesh object is, and they still don't know whether or not it is related to that fire in the sky that everyone saw. So the mystery continues. We're live in South Miami. Tiffany Helberg, CBS 4 News Tonight. Thanks, Tiffany.